Hey y'all, it's Rusty with Mossy Oak. Now I wanna talk a little bit about traveling with your bow. The tip I would give you is get in the habit of using a really good hard case to travel with your bow, whether you're flying or driving. Obviously you have to have a good airline approved hard case to fly with your bow and arrow on a hunt. But I'm guilty as the next guy when it comes to just, hey, loading up, heading over to the lease, whatever the case may be, 30 minute drive, five hour drive, six hour drive, it don't matter. If you're driving, it's still a good practice and a good tip to use a hard case to protect that bow. If it's just you in a truck by yourself, yeah, maybe you set it on the back seat, quiver attached, arrows in, everything's good, or just set it on the front seat. But if you got any kind of drive at all, especially if you've got some other equipment in the truck, go ahead and put that bow in a hard case, guys, and put it in the back of the truck. You're gonna be able to keep it safe, keep it protected. Your sights aren't gonna get knocked off. Your air arrest isn't gonna get jacked up. Bow's not gonna become out of tune if it's secured safely in a nice hard case. Okay, also to go along with traveling with your bow in a hard case, I would recommend not putting your broadheads in that hard case with that bow. One wrong move and that broadhead blade, a broadhead blade nicks a string on your bow or nicks a cable or whatever, you're gonna be scrambling trying to find a bow shop, bow tech or whatever to get your bow repaired and all of that. And you may not even be able to find a string that fits it. So why take that chance? I recommend having a bow accessory box, right? For when you travel. Carry those separately in a little small accessory box. And that way you're never gonna have any issues with broadheads cutting your string inside your hard case. So to sum it all up guys, get in the habit of using a good hard case to travel with your bow when you're driving. Obviously you gotta do that when you're flying and don't put those broadheads in that same case with that bow and you'll be in good shape.